Shell students at the Dayton Regional STEM School were assigned the project last month. They were asked to look into the pros and cons of having 3C rail service running through Ohio. And the verdict was 50-50. Listen, there's a, um, there is a train called... Governor-elect John Kasich ruffled feathers and made it on YouTube when he referred to the supporters of 3C Rail as the train cult, saying the idea has been trekking along since he was a child. He says it's just not going to happen, not on his watch. Now some students at the Dayton Regional STEM School say the governor-elect is right. The train is dead. The students were asked to research the issue. For the last month, they've weighed out the pros and cons, looked at economic development and environmental impact studies, even visited the site of the proposed train station in Riverside. Some think it's a great idea. The ridership survey shows that actually a lot of people would ride the train and that we will also generate a lot of money from these people riding the train. Others called it a big waste of taxpayer money. The train only goes on average 39 miles per hour. And I think it's easier just to drive to from Dayton to Cleveland rather than take the train. It's going to take five hours to get there by train. Our data supported the train, but I don't think it's responsible spending of the money. They're not projecting any way it's going to make money except for the taxes from businesses it could help. So where's that $17 million going to come from? The fact that it, it's been shown to work other places, that it could probably work in Ohio. The students are actually presenting all of their research to a panel of judges tonight, and that begins at 6 o'clock at the Dayton Regional STEM School on Pentagon Park Boulevard, and that's in Beaver Creek. We'll let you know who impressed the judges most when the results are out. Reporting live, Sonu Wasu, 2 News on your side.